So you're afraid of scuba diving because it's considered dangerous, because it's expensive, because you're worried you'll run out of air, and because of sharks. Welcome to Feeling Salty, my brand new YouTube channel which I've wanted to make for quite some time and finally built the courage to do so. My name is Tiffany and I will be talking all things scuba diving. Yeah, so let's dive in. Because it's considered dangerous, scuba diving does pose its own risks. However, there are risks in anything you do every day of your life. Going into your car and driving is a risk. Crossing the road is a risk. Staying in bed all day is a risk. You might risk starvation or something. <laughs> if you're looking into doing your open water course, then just have faith that your instructors know exactly what they're doing. They do this for a full-time job. They do it every single day. They've taught thousands of people and you're just gonna be the next one that they teach. So don't freak out about the ocean just yet. Just know that your instructors are gonna teach you everything you need to know and you're gonna leave before you jump in the ocean with all the skills you need. You will feel confident. I know it's just all this pre-dive stuff and all the conceptions and anxieties in your head that are probably overwhelming you right now, but trust me, for someone who didn't go in the ocean their whole life until they turn 18 and I live in Sydney, Australia, you have nothing to worry about. Wait, she lived by the beach her whole life and didn't go in the ocean? Damn. So you're worried that diving is gonna be so expensive. It's actually not that expensive. In Sydney, where I did my open water course, it was about $149. You could probably find something similar to that pretty much anywhere around the world. Um, of course, like travel dive destinations and like Raja Ampad is gonna be more expensive. But if you find something local to you, you'll be able to find something that's more in a lower price range. And that's another thing. Diving is not only a holiday thing. You can dive anywhere around the world, even at home. You might also be worried that you're gonna run out of air during a dive. On your open water course, you're gonna be monitored so heavily. Everyone wants to make sure that everyone's safe and enjoying it and having fun. As long as you keep communicating, like communication is always key when you're diving. Like all these little hand signals like, I'm okay, I'm worried like out of air, you're not gonna run out of air. And if you do, or if you're about to, tell someone and they will help you immediately. <laughs> I'm just trying to get it up normal. Sharks. <laughs> okay, sharks are really cool. I love sharks. You're probably more likely to die from a vending machine or from a coconut. <laughs> falling on your head than from a shark. True story. The reason people are so worried about sharks is media, 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 media. There's TV, there's news, there's stories. Sharks make for awesome footage, awesome horror movies. Like this is where you're getting all your fears from. This isn't real life. Like, do you see Godzilla literally walking down, breaking down cities? No, because it's not real, but it makes for a good story. There's so much you can do to help you overcome the fear of sharks. Research, get yourself educated. Education is key with anything. It's gonna be the fear of the unknown. Like we don't know much about space, so it's scary. We don't know much about the deep sea, so it's scary. There's so much that you can research on them. I'll link down below some like articles that can make you feel more comfortable with sharks, some videos, some amazing Instagrammers, friends that I know that have shark pages and they dedicate basically so much time to proving how sharks are actually really friendly and really docile and they're not just going to attack you. They don't like the smell of blood and they're not gonna actively come and eat your feet off. They're actually pretty scared of you. They'll probably swim away. Just educate yourself. Educate yourself about sharks and you'll feel so much better and then when you see one, you can feel happy instead of scared. So that's probably my four tips on how to feel better about your open water course, about scuba diving. If you haven't tried it, try it. It's the best. 71% of the earth is water. Go and explore. On YouTube, you'll pop up with a circle of feeling salty. If you want to subscribe, click up here. Oh, to YouTube. Yeah. Not Instagram. Okay. You can follow me on Instagram or Facebook, linked below. Or you can subscribe to my YouTube channel up there. If you want to, you don't have to. <laughs> Please do it. <laughs> Okay, thanks so much guys and I'll see you in the next one.